Hello YouTube, this is Brewmaster H coming at you with another beer review and World of Tanks gameplay. Today we're going to review Fresh as Hellas by Boston Beer Company, also known as Sam Adams, which is, you know, why the Sam Adams glass, right? 5.4% ABV. This is a Hellas lager, so a German style lager. Uh, the aroma is flowers and citrus fruit with a hint of grain, so it's got that little sweet background. The appearance is a vibrant yellow with a thick white head. Our flavor is grainy, kind of bready sweetness, followed by a faint citrus flavor and floral taste, and moderate grassy bitterness. Our mouthfeel is medium to light bodied with a drying afterfeel and slightly prickly from carbonation. Overall, this is an easy drinking Hellas lager that should be readily obtainable throughout the U.S. and probably Canada, etc. Um, you know, Boston Beer Company, wherever they sell Boston beer, right? So give this one a go. Uh, the addition of orange blossom to this brew actually deviates it slightly from the original light German lager, but it's still very clean and very drinkable. 5.4% ABV, like I said. I definitely plan to enjoy more of this beer throughout the summer. Hopefully, you guys enjoy this gameplay coming up. We've got a nice little win for you. All right, guys, so check this out. We've got an LTTB game for you today over here on Abbey. I'm trying to platoon up with a couple of guys, and we're going to try to spot stuff in the middle because that's what light tanks do. I'm trying to destroy stuff right there at the beginning, but apparently... That's not going to happen. And I noticed this T-54 Lightweight, after that awesome jump of mine, I noticed that T-54 Lightweight's going straight down the middle with the 1390, so I'm going to go up the side of the Abbey, because I'm skinny enough, you know, for once in my life, to get through that nice little skinny uh, doorway over here. So we're going to try to mess with this Bat Chat and the 1390. Oh, there's the 1390. Auto aim. Auto aim. No. No. Yep. Boom. Got the kill. Bat Chat. Ignoring me. Boom. One. Panther. We're going to track him. Here we go. Waiting for our buddy to get past and then track him. Next. Waiting. Going to shoot the bat. Oh, ran the bat chat and shoot him. Uh oh. Centurion. Bat chat. Panther 88. We are in big trouble. Going to auto aim on the Panther. Going past him. And. Oop. Our Centurion, I believe, hit me. Oh wait, no, 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 it was their Centurion up there on the hill. So I got out of it. I can't believe that Bat Chat didn't absolutely destroy me and the Centurion. I, I don't know what they were doing, but apparently ignoring me is the theme of this battle. So the Centurion looks like he's going up here to try to get some spots. They believe they've won the hill. Our artillery hit that Bat Chat. I'm going to try to finish him, but someone else got in there first. So I'm over here, Centurion. We're going to shoot him, and it looks like tracked him. And we're gonna try to hit him again. Track. Oh, didn't quite get the damage on that. Oh, too bad. But the good news is, I'm not dead, which I should have been probably by all rights. I've got a thousand hit points. I bounced one shot, and I've got a little bit of spotting damage. Oh, artillery shooting at me while I'm trying to shoot their T-49. So we're just gonna run away and. Thankfully, I wasn't right by the IS-3 when that other already fired. Otherwise, I would have gotten hit a second time, and that would have been really painful. We're going to try to take some shots at this RU now. Come on. Oh, there's a good shot in. Waiting. Ignore me. It's cool, RU. Do it. There's a second shot that I think went in, but we didn't notice if we got damage on that one or not. I'm going to try a third shot real quick. Uh, that was about where he was. We'll, we'll see if that helped. We are, of course, in a tier 10 battle. This is a uh, now a tier 8 light tank. Used to be the tier 7 Russian uh, light tank. Uh oh, oh ho spotted. I'm going to see if I can get a side shot, but I'm going to pull back fast because, oh man, if I hadn't done that, I would have been hurting. Now we notice the T-49 going after the uh, artillery and the E-75. The E-75 gets a good shot in, and I can't seem to hit anything with auto aim right now. Oh, someone's shooting at me. Who are you shooting at? This is not cool. And then, here we go. A little auto aim. Ah, finally got a shot in. Coming back for defense. This is always good. And it looks like the E-75 got the kill. So, we're doing really well. The score is 8-3. to three, And we're kicking butt, taking names, and defending even. Like, trying to be a team player. 
Still not a lot of spotting damage, just that original 321 spotting damage. And let's see what we can do. We're going to try to come straight up the middle here. There's a T32 and a T44. Um, I'm faster than both of them. I don't have a lot of hit points, so if they both focus me, they can probably kill me in one shot each. Bat Chat goes down. Enemy Bat Chat artillery. T44 not paying attention. Trying to get the auto aim on and missing my shots. He seems to be ignoring me for some reason, so I'll just, uh, you know, let him have it. One in the pooper. Oh, one from the side. Two in the pooper. How many, how many does he want, apparently? Oh, now it's the side. Excuse me. Oh, I just tracked him there. Didn't get any damage, but got the tracking damage. <laughs> Suckers. So now it's just the Panzerkampfwagen Sieben and the last artillery. And I'm thinking artillery likes to go to K8. And if they don't go to K8, there's a secret little hidey hole at K4 and 5 that they sometimes like to go. So we'll find out where they are. First, K8. They found the one artillery. The last guy didn't spot anyone. I'm on, I'm on my last HE. Nope, no artillery over here. Gonna go check the little hidey hole. Is he there? Will we find him and murder him? Murder is our game after all. So here we go. We're gonna go. It's a good thing we're fast, because that means... Oh! There we saw the artillery tracer. That sneaky little turd. The good news is, we know he's reloading, so... YOLO! Hey, buddy. I got you something. It's real nice. I picked it up at Target. Here's a second one. Kind of like it. All right. So that's... That's our second kill, unfortunately only our second kill, but we're at 2400 damage done in a tier 8 light tank in a tier 10 game, and I don't think I'm going to make it over there. He's got one, two very good autoloaders. I'm just going to say good game and let them finish off the Panzer 7. And that's the game. Let's check out the stat. So here's the stats, guys. First class mastery badge. Nice little confederate um, from platooning up with the guys that I did. Um, and 37,000 credits earned, almost 4K XP earned. So not, not bad at all for being bottom tier. To improve on that, top on my team by damage done. Check that out. 2,400 damage done with two kills. 1,121 XP earned, so top by XP earned as well. Uh, the only guy who out-damaged me was on the enemy team, that Panzer Kampfwagen 7, uh, 2,445. So he only got 41 more hit points than me, which is, I think, hilarious, considering he's top tier. Um, 22 shots fired out of those, 16 hit, 13 penned. You know, I did a lot of shooting on the move and a lot of auto-aim. You know how I you know how I roll by now, guys. A lot of auto-aim and, you know, I just hope for the best, especially in a fast tank. My, my philosophy with lights is if you don't move, you die, which I really would have died if I had let that Bat Chat reload and that Centurion reload and that Panther uh, had been paying attention to anything whatsoever other than, uh, you know, sitting in the middle of the map and getting creamed by my teammates. So... Really, really fortunate that they ignored me. I, I highly recommend getting ignored by the enemy team and having them allow you to shoot them in the butt all day long. That is a great strategy. If you can get them to do that, go for it. Happy, happy hunting, all right? Uh, 26,000 credits of uh, profit. Overall, really good game. I highly recommend playing and, and not dying like that. And... Uh, Hope you guys go out and enjoy yourself some some Hellas Lager from, from Boston Brewing Company. If you enjoyed this, please like, comment, and subscribe. Can't wait to catch you next time. Brewmaster out.